Oh, okay, yep, the flash is on. But whatever, though, um, so, I actually gotta do it. I'm gonna probably upload a toy hunt video first in this video, but, uh, guys, don't, guys can't see, uh, I got this, uh, Dr. Isaac Yankum figure, even though it only says Isaac Yankum right there, but let's get into the figure. Well, I'm thinking about keeping the packaging, though. All right, I'm hoping that the lighting isn't bad. Let's get it into I literally just ended the video to, to take off the flash, but also I needed to take a crap, so. Damn it, where's the damn? Oh, you know what? Let's use this. Okay, guys, I'm gonna use a thumbtack to open this. Packaging. I'm not I'm trying not to ruin it. So if you have a thumbtack, don't end up hurting yourself by stabbing yourself. So. Wait, do I even need this? Oh, yeah. Oh, just right here. I could just use it right here. This better work. I don't feel like going all the way to the kitchen and get the scissors. Okay, this is not really working. I almost got it. Oh, crap. Yep, this is not working. I want to go all the way to get scissors. If the lighting isn't good, I took off um, the flash because it, you wouldn't able to see the figure because of the glare. And also, I don't want to turn on the lamp. The lamp that I use my thumb because I'm lazy. But uh, yeah, I ended up stopping the video and going right into the bathroom. I don't know what happened. I'm going to use this backdrop. I want to like get a bunch of backdrops and then just put them together and make them a um, cool backdrop. So let's get into it. I'm keeping this packaging. So it's the first time in the line, Dr. Isaac Yankum. It's not the first time in the line, Kane figure. Um, this is actually the flash. This is the, this is the only lighting right here. That's uh, my my uh, my phone flash. Actually, it's not really my phone, it's, uh, or whatever. So it includes a dentist hat and a headgear. From the uh, from to my right side, we have Isaac Yankum. And right here, it says Isaac Yankum right there. The lighting isn't the best, or whatever. Then the back, it says a bunch of crap. Might turn around the lighting for that. Turn on the lighting for this. You see the glare right there? Yeah, exactly. So it says Isaac Yankum. So the patient name, it has no name. You can fill that out, believe. So physical name, Dr. Isaac Yankum, DDS. Address, Dector, Illinois. Estimate around 7 foot tall, 300 plus pounds. Uh, exam completed after being in... I can't believe that's some small writing. And he ate it with a DDS preferred by Jerry the King Lawler. Uh, this is just the teeth things, just a bunch of teeth symbols. Right here it says, where it says dental review, it says, in the midst of his rivalry with the Brett, our Jerry the King Lawler rec recruited a friend to drill down the hitman, not just any friend, but a monster of per personification of evil, a dentist, a seven foot. Tall and over reading the doctor to he threatened to excavate Hart from the, the universe. Follow up examples after Bret Hart rendered him toothless, Isaac Yankum hung up his boots, retired from dentistry, and had a, a identity Chris before crap the hell was that? Before discovering his true self. These, these are teeth, they're supposed to be a blood I guess. But that looks like barbecue sauce, just like the tray thing. Okay, so then this is like a it's supposed to be like a folder thing right here. This is him, picture of him, and one nine nine five. I don't know what they're saying it for, but whatever. Then on the left side it says elite flashback, uh, elite collection flashback. Picture of him it says Isaac Yankum, and then Isaac Yankum right here. We have teeth and all those teeth accessories. Well, I'm keeping this packaging. I kept the Macho Man packaging. I keep that the Macho Man final moment. Let's get him out of the packaging. So actually, I took it out. I don't know where I'm gonna just. I want to display the figure. I have to get more shelves somewhere, or I'm gonna put it somewhere. I don't know where I'm gonna put it. Uh, maybe no. I have nowhere to put it. Let me get some more shelves. Yeah, I have shelves. I just need better news. But okay, let's get into accessories. He has his headgear thing, which actually doesn't go down. I thought it did, but he has his. Is it sculpted on there? No, right? Is it? Is this sculpted under? No, it's hard to take off. It's painted black, and then right here we have this clear thing, and it says, it says China. Right here, it says China. I don't know what that has to do with anything. Is it black? Is the headgear thing? It says China in there, where the clear thing it says China. And then he comes with this uh, dentist, what was it, dentist coat. This does not look like a dentist coat. Oh, crap. 
that dense coat was blue, not white. Like, this was back when I could not be sad. Got this dentist coat right here, all white. It's actually, to open it, it's from the side. It's not, you see it's in the side, it's not in the middle, it's in the side where you take it off. But uh, yeah, I might go to the store like tomorrow, get some new shelves to display him. Oh wait, no, I can put him right there. He has a space right there on my cabinet where I gotta remove all that crap and I have some new space. This is actually a pretty big figure. I had a cane figure before, basic, but the leg ended up, it was such an old figure. It was um, the Undertaker and uh, oh, that, that thing is like a smelling scent thing. Uh, I'm just saying, but uh, it, it was a, uh, this was like one of the, so it, it came with the Undertaker in a two pack when uh, Kane was, uh, he had no shirt or, and it came with the World Heavyweight Championship. It's, it was a very, um, long time ago, probably like 2011, but the leg came off because it was so old. The Undertaker, I believe, I lost, and I lost the World Heavyweight Championship too that came with it. But yeah, let's go to the head. He has his like type of curly here thing going to the top all the way to the black to the to the back his neck it's brown he has a bunch of gold teeth the beard thing he has some eyebrows his eyebrows are up his eyebrows are looking up and his eyes are like i don't know what happened his eyes oh, wait hold on oh never mind I thought they were gonna do like what they did to a left figure but change the pupil thing but his teeth are actually, uh, they are yellow with some brown things. I don't know if you can really see them or not. Uh, yeah, he's, I don't know, you can't really see that. But he's kind of, uh, he's kind of grinning. That's the type of head skin he has. He has these arms, which he has, all he has on the arms is wrist tape on both hands, black wrist tape. That's it. Nothing really, it's kind of a little, look at his arms. They're kind of like full of muscle, actually. This thing could focus better. He's kind of like bulky in his arms. This one too. His arms, not really loose. This head is not loose actually. Articulation is good. Uh, these arms, I feel like these arms will get pretty loose. Uh, Cause look, they're already moving easily. But I know how to change, I know how to fix that, but I'm just so lazy. Um, I did it before to one of my figures, but then he has, or he has like the longest legs ever. I'm not even playing. Uh, so he has these, these uh, blue jeans. Just plain blue jeans. I don't know why they have all these design things and all that. But, uh, but here we have blue jeans. Torso articulation. But these legs are going to get loose. But I'm going to have to fix that. Uh, it's, it might not work, but I'll try to fix it. This torso is really loose. It's like my Stone Cold torso. That Stone Cold Torso has a rubber band around his torso because it's freaking really loose. He has this. He's not really a bulky guy from like his chest or anything. Just kind of a normal torso for a seven footer. And uh, you can see right here. I don't know what this thing is for. What, yeah, what what are these things for? I don't know. But I believe right here you could yeah right here you could turn it. The same with the uh, some main the rock. I believe the rock has a figure like this. You could turn this. I don't know why they did that. They should just. I understand why, but they just did kind of like what they did to an elite figure, like. But whatever. But his knees. Oh, is his knees even loose? No, his knees are pretty good. They're not loose. I was painted blue inside. Pretty good. I'm seeing nothing really chipping. The first. Oh, so I was in line. I checked the figure, and then I realized that there was like a kind of a stain thing on his jeans, and then it went back. Most of them had stains, but this one didn't. And then he has some uh, black boots, and that's it. Plain black boots. Bottom just plain black boots. Nothing really detailed about this here. Again, for the accessories. Actually, when it first came out, I really liked it. I even went to the Toys R Us website. Couldn't find it until I uh, got a certain link. I copied it. Um, I was even I was on like, DMing a lot of people on Instagram saying they wouldn't get the sticker. I ended up just finding it. Um, it was either this or the main kind of leaf. I want I want to get the main kind of leaf, but then I saw this. Tried to decide to get it, but. Definitely gonna keep this packaging. Think about putting that up in my cabinet thing where I have my deodorants in a picture frame and I have a bunch of other stuff I can just move out. So yeah, that's gonna be for this video guys. Uh it should be a toy hunt video first in this video. I don't know. I'll see.